Hey guys, it's Jay, and today I'm here with a review for the book What We Buried by Kate A. Borman. I was sent this copy by the publisher for exchange of my honest opinion, so here it is. I ended up giving this book a 4.5 out of five stars. So without further ado, let us get started. So this follows siblings, Jory and Liv, who have always been complete opposites. Liv has been paraded around for her whole life as a beauty queen in the pageant circuit by their mother. Jory has a partial facial paralysis, which leaves him feeling very inadequate and like he is always in Liv's shadow. When Liv announces that she is going to be suing her parents for damages on her childhood, Jory thinks that this is another one of her stunts for attention and he is not very approving of this. So when the day of the trial arrives and his parents end up going missing, Jory and Liv need to work together in order to find them and figure out what happened. I won't lie, for most of this book, I was so confused with what I was reading. It was honestly the biggest mindfuck ever, but I couldn't stop reading. It was so addictive and I stayed up so late trying to figure out what was going on and where the story was going to progress from where I was. The story is told in alternating perspectives between Liv and Jory and it's also told in two different timelines, the present and then flashbacks to their childhood and I think that it was really interesting to see how the two siblings had the same childhood and had the same memories but the way that they interpreted them was very different from each other and I think that was like super well done. I think that it was a huge eye-opener to see how each of the children were influenced and affected by their childhood from their abusive parents. The book is definitely a very character-driven story without a lot of plot. For most of the book it's them in a car driving across the country trying to find their parents but like talking about their childhood and figuring out how they were affected in different ways and then trying to come to an understanding of each other. You sympathize with both Jory and Liv so much as the story unfolds and you learn more about each of the characters. I personally really love unreliable narrators so both of the characters in this book were so amazing to me. I really loved learning more about them and watching them grow as people and learning to understand each other again. I really liked the way that they learned to communicate with each other and their feelings again because you could tell when they were children they were really close and then they just kind of drifted apart and it was really nice to see them grow back together again. I definitely think that this is a book that you should try to go into as blind as possible without knowing too much about the premise because it <laughs> makes for the biggest mindfuck ever. It definitely wasn't what I expected of this story, but I'm really glad that I picked it up. I'm honestly super confused with the ending and I've been thinking about it ever since I read it. I have so many theories about what it meant, but I'm still like, I, I have no idea what happened, but I loved it for some reason. Usually I'm really frustrated when I can't figure out like a specific explicit ending, but I don't know, something about this book made it okay for me. But overall, I think that it was really addictive, super compelling, very thought-provoking, and I definitely recommend it if you're into thrillers. I also want to say that the cover is super creepy, but it's so fitting for the story once you read it, so definitely check this book out if you get the chance. Alright guys, so that was my review for What We Buried by Kate A. Borman. Thank you so much to the publisher for sending this out to me. I really appreciate it. I ended up loving it so much. Let me know down below if you guys are interested in the book or if you've read it already and what you thought of it and I'll see you all in my next video. Goodbye!